Hello everyone, my name is Travis with Unco Incorporated and today's tutorial is teaching you how to uh, make a new partition within your hard drive on Windows 7. This should work for Windows XP and Windows Vista, but no guarantees. Sorry for that. <laughs> Said a little bit fast. So first off what you want to do is go to your start menu and then right click computer and then select manage. From here you want to go ahead and select storage, double click it, and then disk management. Alright, now here's all my drives. And in this case, I'm on the C drive, which I'm pretty sure a lot of you are. So here's my main drive, 594 gigabyte. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and right click and do shrink volume. And since this will take a while, since it's recording, I'll go ahead and pause the video. Alright, now that it's finished, you should get a window looking basically similar to this. And if it says size of available shrink is zero, or does not let you enter any amount that you want, you may want to go ahead and uh, reboot your computer completely. I've had this issue before where I could not put anything in here except for like a gigabyte, which was really irritating. And if you have any other partitions on your computer that are already in here that are uh, made within the hard drive, they may not work. You may have to remove those. I had the issue. I had Linux on here and I already removed that. So in this case, I'm going to add 50 gigabyte. I'm going to go ahead and go to my start menu and type in calculator. And this is because I'm going to calculate how many megabytes is, a, is 50 gigabyte. So in this case, a megabyte is equal, I mean, no, a gigabyte is equal to 1,024 megabytes. So I'll go ahead and put 1,024 times 50, which is the amount of gigabytes I want. And I go ahead and get uh, 51,200. On here, I want to uh, highlight this and type in 51,200. And then select shrink. And... Uh, this shouldn't take the long, like less than 30 seconds. And then once that is done, you basically have your new partition. It should show up as a black uh, box, but in this case, I'll just go ahead and pause the video and uh, zoom it so I can let you see. Alright guys, now that it's finished, uh, you should get a space that looks like this. It says unallocated, and I chose 50 gigabyte as I said like 50 times. And I'm going to go ahead and right click it and do new simple volume. You'll get a similar window like this again opening up. Just go ahead and click next, next, and then assign whatever letter to the drive you want it to be. In this case, I'll do A because this is an A plus tutorial. I'll click next. I'm going to name it Windows XP since I'll go ahead and try and install it. And then I'll go ahead and select next again, and then select finish. And it should create as a partition, and basically you can install whatever operating system you want, or let's say you just want to put some spare files on there. It's basically whatever you want. It won't be your primary boot partition unless you make it your primary boot partition. Anyways guys, thanks for watching, and if there's any specific tutorials, please uh, leave it down in the comments. I'll go ahead and make sure to make it as fast as possible, and uh, thank you for watching.